So the next trick we're going to work on is something called perch work. This builds on your uh, pause up trick. What we're going to do is they're going to do a pause up and then they're going to move their back legs and, and turn around um, without taking their front legs off. So how I'm going to start this is I'm going to reinforce the paws up first. I'm going to do a couple of those before I ask for movement. So this next one, I'm going to introduce some motion to it. Ready? Pause. Good girl. I'm going to give her a couple in place first. And then I'm just going to add a little bit of motion. Good girl. If she falls off in the beginning, that's okay. We don't want to get too greedy with it. Self-corrected, so I clicked once she got back on, and that's okay. In the beginning, they're gonna do that. Good girl. Free, and then I'm gonna free her and let her get off and reduce the pressure. Okay, pause. I'm still gonna click that first one. And I'm gonna start moving a little bit. Girl. The more you do it, the more motion you can add. Good girl. Good girl. Free. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Eventually, once you really build this up, you can start adding a lot more speed to it. So with this, you want to be careful you don't do too much. It is really hard on them, on them so they will uh, get tired pretty easily. So you want to take this slow, do very short sessions, and then call it a day. Um, you can do other stuff with them, but we don't want to do too much of that at once in the beginning um, because it does use a lot of core strength and rear end strength. And that's your perch work trick.